In severe shock, the average mortality rate is 35% before arrival to hospital. In cardiac arrest, mortality rate is 64% before arrival to hospital. Only 2.3% of cardiac arrest patients leave hospital with normal cognition. Providing life-saving treatment in emergency cases of severe shock or cardiac arrest is extremely challenging. How can current survival rates be increased? Introducing the HemaShock. HemaShock is an innovative auto-transfusion tourniquet for increasing survival. HemaShock shifts around one liter of blood when placed on both legs and blocks the return of the blood to the legs. This blood shift increases chances of ROSC in cardiac arrest and increases blood pressure in shock, allowing the transfer of the patient to a medical facility in stable condition. Hemoshock is a bridge to further treatment. When blood volume and vascular volume match and the pump is functional, blood pressure is normal. Reduced blood volume. When blood volume is down, hypovolemic shock, or when the vascular volume is pathologically increased, distributive shock, blood pressure and tissue perfusion fall. Hemoshock squeezes the blood from the legs to the core while blocking its re-entry, increasing the venous return to the heart and directing blood flow to the essential organs. The Hemoshock's robust construction of a steel spring, handles, and elastic stockinette ensures durability and flexibility. It is one size fits all for adult legs. Hemoshock is easy to apply. Assess vital signs. Remove the patient's shoes and with no further delay, insert Hemoshock on the toes of one leg. Roll Hemoshock up to the groin by pulling the handles. Repeat the vital signs. If still necessary, roll the second Hemoshock up the other leg. In the case of cardiac arrest, apply the Hemoshock on both legs with no delay. Hemoshock is easily carried in ambulances, helicopters, and in hospital crash carts. Hemoshock technology is scientifically validated and widely registered. Be sure to give your patients the best initial life-saving treatment with Hemoshock.